hello guys this is about Nexins and uh, Nexins is a way is a way in which uh, we avoid repeating our codes in different classes so as you can see here we have class animal class crocodile class shark owl dove and a dog so we all know that all animals breathe so if you want to make class crocodile access the animal we extend the class animal here extend animal here because a crocodile breathes same case to a shark extends animal same to all dove and a dog copy copy this a all also breathes and all sorry a dove breathes and a dog breathes now we've made them access the class animal so we all know that a crocodile swims so we can give a method of swimming to crocodile and the other animals that swim so we give a method here void swim different swims same case to a shark a shark swims shark swims a shark swims and a crocodile swims and all when a dove fly you can give them a class a, a method here flying void void fly Flying. Don't forget your semicolon. A dove also flies, so we can take this method. What about a dog? A dog swims. I'm sure there's no dog that flies. So we can take the method for shark and crocodile for the dog. Because we, are, we know that dogs swim. So in this case, we have seen that uh, we have written our codes to a specific class. So we want now to minimize these codes by use the using Nixins. Nixins enable us uh, use minimal code to to access to give a class what we want it to access. So let's start with the animals that swim. We use the keyword mixin. Mixin. Uh, can use a mixing called swim yeah swim let me print something here void uh, swimming yep print something here print animal swims yep so we used one mixing we've created a mixing so if we want uh, a crocodile to access uh, the mixing we give it the access here line 5 with the mixing word swim We've given the crocodile access to the mixing. We can come here and confirm in our in our void function var croc is equal.
close to crocodile and can crocodile dot so you can see that a crocodile has access to swimming and breathing here so that's how we confirm that the crocodile has access to the to the mixing so we don't need the we don't really need this line again here we don't need it because it has already accessed the mixing we no longer need to do it from that point same case let's undo this same case to our shark let's give a shark access to the mixing So we no longer need this line again because it has access to the mixer. What about our animals that fly? We create another mixing for flying. Mixing. Fly. You can choose whichever word you want to use. Void. Flight. I'm just using random uh, adjectives or adverbs you can print what you want to print now this animal uses wings to fly yeah we've created a mixing now for flying so we want the dove and the all to access our mixing. We give it access using the word with with our mixing fly. So we no longer need this line. We no longer we also no longer need this line for the dove. Let's give access with fly. That's our mixing. We no longer need this line, sorry for it. Yeah, what about our dog? We said that our dog swims. So we give it a, the mixing name with swim. that is it guys like we can see that we no longer have those lines of codes inside our classes so in this in this in this case a crocodile is able to breathe and is able to to swim that's all about mixings but uh, I'm sure practice would make you perfect in this you can use your own classes can choose a topic from maybe vehicles we say this vehicles uh, uses diesel or petrol this one is four four by four this one is not yeah with practice i'm sure you're going to make it perfect that is it on mixing side